morning. My name is Donald Crandall. Well, I am a two, I'm a second recipient, and I was granted the first time. I helped out with the marathon dance band, is what I call it. And the marathon dance band is about 26 years old and needs some help. So I came back to you guys actually as a joke almost saying, hey, the marathon dance needs some love, and you guys chose me again, which was an honor. Well, like I said, the van is getting very old. I carry precious cargo. I have two grandchildren that now go in the back of that thing, and it's not up to date on safety issues and stuff like that. And it's got a lot of health problems. It's got issues all over left and right, and I've done what I could do to save it. And it's not happening. Without the van, I'm stuck. I have no place to go, nowhere to get there, how to do it. It's not that easy just for me to jump into a car and get out. I can't go borrow a car, things like that. So the van is everything to me. I take I go down to see the grandson's baseball games, soccer games, the granddaughter, grocery store runs, all kinds of runs. I'm the runner, the wife works very hard, and I'm, I'm the go-getter. And that's what makes me go, is the van. It was an honor. At first, I didn't, I know my community because I lived here long enough now, and I felt like there were better deserving people in the community for me to get chosen it was a shocking thing. I did. It all sort of started off as, hey, the marathon dance band needs some help. And then out of nowhere, I got chosen to be a recipient who would know something like that to be. So, yes, thank you. That's, that's what it was like. It was, it was complete. I didn't feel an honor. I didn't feel like I was worthy to get it. I've missed you guys the last couple of years. I love coming to the dance and seeing you guys dance in the gym. It's awesome. Ever since I was a recipient, was it 2017? I was there, so I missed the last three. And let's do it again. Let's go Bulldog Pride and let's go dancers! Let's go! <laughs>